And welcome back, my friends. Welcome back to ever so amazing turn based chronicles with errors. Not really, but yes, it happens. Uh, we're playing, of course, Allied Core with DMP skins, everything in part one with description, with sexuality, with everything. Anywho, last time we got a little bit demoralized, to be honest. I got a little bit uh, demoralized because we lost immediately the new guys, the new engineering unit and that's kind of a bad like Karo Armato annihilated those fucktards and it was a GG for a soul specifically for them two attacks and like they got destroyed in this corner here I'm hoping for some attack with paratroopers upon this 105 take Kapuzo and take Salem and just just you know get a little bit of love get a little bit of requisition back for all the problems but the question is how much requisition we're we gonna be getting from these that's the real question. Now, of course, body again heavily defended. We're not going to do much against that. It's not even our objective, but we're doing it as a side objective for money purposes. And that's it. Uh, so here we're going to be doing nothing. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking of moving, like, hoping first to take this thing, because we need it. And that is the airfield. We need to take it, like, in a few more turns. I, I think it's... 7 max turns to have it take that or, or 58, I do not, honestly, cannot remember. But the point is that we're gonna be doing something, I'm gonna be sexy like this. And I'm gonna utilize our bomber to maybe annihilate a little bit. Now the big Bertha in this case, she does an amazing job, uh, you know, this, what she does is just pure sex. She's just amazing that much. Uh, so let me just see what I can do here. Yeah, now this heavy infantry, the Imperial Guard, that is our greatest infantry, it only has trucks, and that's problem, of course. Only has trucks, and that is a problem. Mm, it would seem I can resupply a unit, I don't know how, why it's full and everything. Is it? Oh no, it's the fuel, that is specifically for the truck itself. Derp, of course! Uh, okay, well, that aside, I might move a little bit here. A little bit. No, no, I'm not going to risk it because of the car or motto here. going to be annihilating us somewhat if we do that. Uh, we have already have infantry here. We can hope... Yeah, I'm going to move in. Oh, only... Oh, wow, wow, really? One damage on us and five on that. But we're going to be waiting for our guys here for... Well, to be honest, we can already annihilate this one for one damage or wait every single goddamn turn for our engineers. So... Six damage, that's good. That's actually good. Good. Annihilate that. In the next turn we can immediately uh, surround these bastards. Annihilate this uh, beautiful 149mm gun and have fun with the enemy. Indeed we will. Now of course Matilda being as slow as, as uh, is a slug. <laughs> it's not going to be really fun. But nonetheless, let's move to, we're gonna annihilate the enemy howitzer here, the mobile howitzer, and we're gonna annihilate the A gun, so our beautiful things can move in. As you he already got damaged on uh, the Raven. Raven got pretty much damaged by this goddamn AA gun. It was a big no-no, but we shall see how this specific part is gonna be. First time we're seeing the Katrenschutzen, uh, Kradrenschutzen, something shoots in the bicycle people which is not a bicycle but it's, um, it's, it's something like a bicycle anywho these bastards uh, this location here where, where the, as you can see the enemy air raid has returned back probably to the airfield to resupply and all the good stuff move here and at the moment the enemy is not really attacking to brook i was expecting them to be attacking to brook uh, but they're not attacking to brook at all like at all i was expecting worse but that's fine, as soon as we get back behind this batch, we're gonna be annihilating these. We're gonna move soldiers from Tobruk onto them, and we're gonna just make a sandwich out of them. But first, let's deal with the already big problems we're having here. We're gonna, we're kind of stagnating here at a specific point, because honestly, the minefield, not helping. And already, a loss of a one major core unit, not helping. I could get a new one, I'm not gonna do that at all, no point now. Okay, so at this point here, let me see, I have my beautiful air, nothing again I can do, I'm, I think I moved actually every single unit, I did everything I could with every single goddamn unit, so it's time for to end the turn and see how that's gonna go. Okay, that big 105, still doing nice damage against us, now they're attacking again, specifically attacking these 
evil thing. There comes that Karden Schutzen or Krader Schutzen or something Schutzen. Oh, and complete annihilation from the AT gun and a retaliation at the end by a few survivors. Fine. Okay, fine. But it's always about blitzkrieging your goddamn enemies, you know? It's always about blitzkrieging your goddamn... I didn't want to do that, but fine. Again, the point is they also destroyed this. Because we are amazing like that. Uh, I'm gonna allow... <laughs> I'm gonna allow speed to have fun with this, mo this motorcycle. And it can actually do kind of damage. So we're gonna utilize the auxiliary units to do some damage upon this bastion. And let's see the damage. Inflict three here or just annihilate these bastions, hopefully. One, really? Really? Come on, speed? You could have done better than that. Fine. Let's annihilate the enemy artillery gunners. It's time to take this goddamn city with everything that we have. My infantry here. Infantry here. As you can see, that's gonna be kind of a damaging for us. Definitely. So it's time to have fun. As you see, this thing is in complete threat. Let's see if the quake can do a maximum amount of damage. Six. There you go. One. Excellent. Fine. Run away for as much as well, for as long as you want. Like that. It's, it's GG for you. We can't take that. Yeah, as you can see, I now have to run because the fuel is low on Hurricanes, Raven and Blood are having issues. And if we are not yet taking that damnable thing, <laughs> that's for sure. It's time to GTFO out of here. 26. Not good. Not good at all. That's why we need to get this airfield as fast as possible. Okay, it's time for us to nuke, well, to lower the enemy inside this city, to lower the, 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 the president, <laughs> suppress them completely, if possible. I mean, these are the new guns, you know, it was like, well, the new guns are supposed to be doing something, you know, the Imperial Guard will still lead you never. the Imperial Guard is gonna have fun, wow, really, you still did a damage upon us, that's kind of sad, for... Let's annihilate you, you son of a bitch. Honestly, that was a dickish move by the enemy. I did not like that. At all. So let's see. Let's immediately annihilate these bastards here with Fast and Furious. And we have, of course, we have Doom. And Doom can probably annihilate one of these bastards uh, right here immediately. Or get rid of this batch and then come back here now. Let's annihilate the artillery first. I just hate artillery. And they're gonna always attack you as a support unit. If we attack this, the artillery would open fire still upon our uh, beautiful doom. And that's GG anyway. So yeah. Excellent stuff. Excellent stuff indeed. Uh, let's see. Stay where you are. We're gonna annihilate this bastard. We're not gonna allow him to move. If he can't move... Be you know if we were close like bef like before when before the goddamn engineering team died, the engineering unit died, and you guys died, we should have well we didn't know that there were like two goddamn first of all we didn't know that there were, there were two damnable Kara Armata tanks right there. But if we did, we just position them close to the enemy, and they they wouldn't be able. They can only move one hex. But you know what was was, and now it's our time to just move in and rape, pillage, and burn. Okay, engineers, what shall I do with you? Honestly, we are already there, and we just need to push the enemy. So this is my. T this is what I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna attack from this location, kill the suck suckers here, move these bastards down here, and take everything here. That's gonna be the gist of it. Like move every goddamn unit here. If we attack here, you know, like this is gonna be a problem. Because honestly, we would be in we would be sandwiched by the enemy. This this way, we destroyed this, hold this flank against these bastards, destroy this, then move every single enemy, like every single unit we have into Brook, around to Brook, and surround these places. Take the main stuff that we have to take, and end the goddamn siege of to Brook, and get these guys also out of here. Two point A, and it's a GG. At least I'm hoping that's how it's gonna work. 
Okay, in terms of my beautiful uh, engineer salamanders, I honestly have no idea what am I gonna do with you. But that's fine. They're not gonna be attacking the city, that's for goddamn sure. I mean, these guys are already dead. You know, like, you are already dead. Uh, so, yeah, moving on. <laughs> Consider again that the Matilda is so slow, it does take a little bit of patience. <laughs> to have a, like, holy crap, like, honestly. Excellent job. Now the questions, questions, and questions, and more questions. It's time to annihilate you, fuck turds. Let's see who can get, you can get there, you can get not there, you, you need to be closer. So I'm gonna go for what exactly, but I wanna get rid of these guys first, then move here. And plus these are all auxiliary units, so I don't give a fudge what happens to them, just saying. I'm not being a dick about it, I'm just saying the fact. Stating the goddamn fact. Uh, so, I'm gonna support you. I'm gonna support you with two damage there on that 105. That sex like a beast indeed. Uh, a question what to utilize against one. How good are you against infantry? Five. Compared to this regular infantry four. So definitely these guys are supposed to be the first guys to attack these. But see. The problem here is that the enemy artillery will open fire upon us and the enemy grenadiers are just gonna have fun. They're gonna f have a field day with us and that's not a good thing at all. So yeah, this is gonna be a little bit of waited out. Move attack, destroy these bastards, then attack from the sides and you know, all the good stuff. We'll see how that's gonna work in general, but at the moment it doesn't feel right, but it's awesome. Missed, thank you very much. So let's see how the Grenadiers deal with us, the paratroopers. 2-2, two, two, fine, you know, tit for tat and all that bullshit. That's great. Plus we roll a little bit of these guys up against these guys so that our paratroopers uh, they can attack the big gun, destroy the big gun, kill these guys, move in or surround these guys, do something. You know, we have a lot of turns to think about that. As long as we don't lose everyone. There, that's gonna be a new good thing. Okay, and the turn and see how this is gonna go. Again, enemy opening fire and dies 325 pounder. That's a good, not a good thing. No enemy air raid. Here they come, guys. Here they fucking come. Attacking paratroopers, 25 pounder opening fire. Not a good dealio whatsoever. Consider that all my air units are going back to resupply. That's gonna be a bad stuff. Like, this thing needs to fall immediately. Immediately. Uh, three. Uh, oh, come on! Really? One left. Okay, fine. Thank you. Let's take that airfield. Excellent. It's ours, guys. It's ours. Paratroopers, these are auxiliary paratroopers. We don't care much about them. Wow, really? One really? Oh, come on. Come on! Uh, okay, well, salamanders deal with these bastards. Thank you, excellent job. Now we have a problem with an enemy air. This bastard is gonna do massive damage. No, actually two and one. Wow, this guy uh, is actually excellent against air, but not good against anything else. That's great. That's uh, not so great. I mean, we have Big Bertha right here, and she's gonna get fudged in the ass because of that. So, first and foremost, Doom, have fun, 5. Retaliation does nothing, he runs away, initiative plus 1, Joseph Collins, that's always a nice thing indeed. But let's get rid of you finally, because honestly this one Carl Armato is just taking too long to destroy and he's wasting my turns because of that. 1, excellent. Let's put our fire and flash and flash and thunder and fire and flash to have a little bit of fun. Heavy infantry destroys that. Great job, Imperial Guard. These are our elites after all. Excellent job. Beautiful taking that. Get a little bit of prestige. Always a good thing considering that the amount of stuff we might be fighting very soon is going to be tremendous. It's going to be fucking tremendous. Okay. Oh yeah, we do have uh, the airfield here. So we can just go right here unless we encounter the AA gun in this blackness of the universe. And that's gonna immediately do an ambush upon our Big Bertha, which would not be a good thing. And Big Bertha is on 43 out of 74 fuel. 
it's not really a bad thing. Considering again, Big Bertha, specifically these massive bombers are just for suppression and nothing else, honestly. Yeah, enemy engineers, pioneers. Come on, move it, pioneers! Uh, so yeah, all in all, they have a few stuff here. No, no minefield at the moment that we can see. Fine by me. We're gonna be moving Matilda. Matilda's gonna get that first kill. It would seem. <laughs> it's gonna. She's gonna have the most fun. Paratroopers on front. Go go go. Oh yeah, I cannot supply paratroopers. Interesting. Really, I can't. I, I already did an attack, so that's why I can't. Okay. Uh, okay. Well, that's done. We've taken the city. She's gonna have fun now by moving up front. Uh, the, uh, utilize Doom and Quake to deal with this bastard here. Uh, get, of course, Lehman Ross up there. Get the Steel Legion up here also. Uh, uh, problem is gonna be this. I'm hoping he doesn't do any massive, overly too massive damage. Uh, let's see the viewpoint of from him is what? Two. So I have to avoid his viewpoint uh, with uh, my artillery or he might just go for it. Or someone might attack my artillery from this location. We are fucked. There's nobody's guarding that artillery. Good job, demon. We might get completely annihilated here. I mean completely annihilated. But I think that this batch is going to go for specifically for Big Bertha. And Big Bertha might have a few issues with that. Okay, Big Bertha, let's deal with this batch. It's a little bit of damage is never a bad thing. Even if suppression is something. This guy's gonna be done for the next. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Let's open fire. Six. Oh, yay! Full eight on the 105. 105 goes down. The paratroopers did an amazing job there. The paratroopers did an amazing fucking job there. And I'll first let's bomb these batches with 25 pounders. There we go. A little bit of grenadiers lowers that beautiful uh, morale. Let's see who does the most damage. It's gonna be, of course, my infantry here. Two, excellent job. Falls back. That's good for you, not good for me, though. Excellently not. <laughs> Excellently not. Come on, you could have done that. Uh, did we actually... Uh, we did annihilate them. It, it looked like one. But it's okay. It's actually... It was two. Excellent job. Now we... The only thing we can do here is surround them with two units from this angle, from this road, and this part, and then bomb them. So... This is going to be the next, Fort Capuzzo is going to be the next thing that everybody concentrates upon. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Okay. Excellent job. Guys, excellent job. Uh, no enemy air in this region, so I'm thinking of moving the new guy. Uh, towards, of course, the main uh, combat area. It would seem that there's not gonna be much done there anyway. We have the 25 pounders, so he will be able to suppress the guys inside the cities. That's fine. That's freaking fine. Uh, okay, that's done there. Everybody's done here. Everything we have done, that's it, right? Yes, it is. Let's move a little bit to this location. Oh, wait, Fast and Furious. We're getting close to the infantry, not the full infantry, if you notice, it's only five of the Wehrmacht infantrymen and the pioneers. The pioneers can be easily dem demolished by, I mean, these guys are specifically only for demolishing, well, stupid stuff. But it seems they have a nice uh, attack f uh, on the infantry, strangely enough, compared to with these also elements. Okay, they may be good, maybe they're good, they're amazing, we'll see soon enough, we will see soon enough. In this location, again, we can't, we can't do anything. Everything is out of reach for us. Everything is out of reach for us. Oh, man, we have to annihilate the... As soon as we annihilate these guys, good thing is these are the regular Italian troops, not these uh, Bersaglieris, which are going to give us such a headache. But we'll see. End the turn, will you please? One... I was afraid with that massive explosion, it's gonna be 15 or something. Wow, really? <laughs> like, I didn't expect even to do one damage against that. And the, of course, engineering pioneer is moving in. And that's it for the enemy. And that's it for the enemy. Fine, first let's concentrate on these guys here. I wanna know what the hell am I gonna be doing about these guys. 
Well, let's get you out of there. Let's get you out of there. Let's get you closer to the enemy, if possible. We can one bomb it with a 25 pounder, lower that downable thing. If we can push it back, that's being a bit fine. Like, we just push it back a little bit. Fuck off. You know, so we can surround these guys and fudge them up in the ass. Yeah, these guys don't even have basic stuff. Like, they do not have vehicles to traverse the most of the terrain. Okay. It's time to move in with the Hurricanes. With the Raven and Blood. Or a Blood Raven, that is. And of course, they're, gonna pre they're pretty much far away. So that's not a good mojo. Let's surround you first and foremost. Five. No damage, thank you very much. Five. Four, of course. Of course. He does also damage. <laughs> like, fuck off, bitch. Fuck off, I say. And, of course, the Imperial Guard finishes off the target. And the target is ours. The target is ours. This is gonna be the problem is we do not have a sight towards this area. I'm gonna move in. Just to get the fucking sight, I cannot allow the enemy to do the bad and the ugly when it comes to my artillery guns. Like, that, that, that would be the worst. If they come from the right flank and just annihilate Thunder and Flash, would be the worst goddamn thing to happen. Let's get these guys a little bit of supply going, because again, that is... The, oh wait, first let's annihilate these bastards. Big Bertha, please. You have the honor of suppressing the bastards, and we're gonna have honor with annihilating you maybe with... Well, to be honest, both units are kind of fucked. Uh, Matilda, you can go right here. Infantry, right here. We're gonna have a little bit of fun, we're gonna have uh, just a tad bit of uh, fun. And of course, Lemon Rust in between all these bastards. And I'm gonna allow Lemon Rust to take the kill, maybe. Yeah, I'm gonna allow Lemon Rust, to, or maybe lower these guys. Choices, choices. Indeed, too. Fine, fine. You can't do anything against the goddamn Churchill bastard, you bastards. Uh, two? Why not? Oh, I was hoping for two and then get the kill with the uh, speed. But speed was not cool enough for that. Fine, I say, fine. How much resupply? 64. I think it would be smart to get that because we're still in the very core of the, you know, the center of the, the battlefield. And this could go pretty freaking long. It's just already uh, uh, turn 6 and we haven't captured really anything. Of, you know, like we did capture one main target before turn 7. But the thing is we need to get these guys out of there, which shouldn't be really much of a problem, but taking these locations feels like it's going to be a real chore. We need four positions, like four main targets to capture. I don't know if they count the targets we already have, like this town we have, it's, it's a golden thing, so we have it, right? So we now have captured uh, this uh, airfield, there goes, like, we have two, and of course we need two out of this. It, oh, you know, we still need all three, I mean, we should, like, capture everything here, we should. And plus we have the Tobruk, right? Or was the airfield? No, the airfield wasn't anything. Yeah, it was just a side objective and that's it. Okay, so in reality we don't have hold anything. We're, we're douchebags. We're actually douchebags. Uh, resupply, thank you very much. Uh, let's see, infantry. Deal with the Steel Legion. Full kill. Always a nice thing to get a full kill and get that XP, that nice sexy XP. Supply, let's see, let's first supply them with ammunition, more important than anything else to be honest. Then move forward and attack these bastards. And that's it, right? Yes, we're gonna have a problem with this specific thing, we might do a few damage against, but it's only one and it still does a nice damage against our ground targets. Well, that is our ground units. Uh, nonetheless, let's end this and let's see how this is gonna go. Yeah, yeah, going for four. Come on! That's bullshit. It says one, like one. Blood Raven, everyone. The new guy, everyone. On top of this son of a bitch. Not allow him to leave. Who's gonna have 
the most fun here. It would seem blood can get the least amount of damage. And we did we annihilate immediately? No. We did not. Raven or the new guy? New guy do a little bit of damage. Yeah, you, he's gonna get a little bit of damage. And completely annihilating the goddamn enemy target. You, you need immediate replacements, and I do not care. Immediate replacements for you, my friend. Immediate goddamn replacements. We push the Germans, those little guys, out of there. We're gonna resupply the paratroopers. We can do a little bit of damage here and there and everywhere. You see, the, the good thing about air, we have these big guns. We can attack these enemy artillery before even moving our infantry overly too close. And they're gonna be doing that. We're gonna avoid getting really surrounded by the enemy, but it's gonna be the thing, that's for sure. You know, I feel it's gonna be the thing. And we don't have a huge chunk of units to push them now, for now that is, so that's fine, I guess. Uh, strangely enough, we don't have any ships that we had before. I was expecting, you know, we had so many triumphant victories, you would expect a little bit of support. But the game tells you no. The game tells you no. You shall not have it. Matilda can get in and do some damage, considering that she is pretty fucking strong, and of course Churchill, that is the Lehman Ross. Five... Yeah, choose your destiny as they say. He has to go somewhere, down, up, that's the question, maybe not. And there goes the big boy, this was the big artillery piece, right? The biggest at the moment that has to take into Brook, that is surrounding to Brook, at the moment that we can see. With that gun, we can easily move in our soldiers and have fun with that. Okay, let's move our soldiers and have fun with that. Uh, how uh, this, of course, also artillery piece too. So yeah, you won't be able to catch us. Let's get the steel legion here. Good enough. To be honest, we're gonna have to make a nice triangle formation, delta. If need be, we can call it the Delta. Uh, yeah. The problem is, let's see the view side of you. Uh, two is for a range, and let's see the view. How much you can only one? Okay, so we can adjacent territory here. Okay, no enemy stuff at the moment we can see here. Specifically, so we can attack this bastard uh, with speed and fast and furious. You know, just pick out a few enemy targets and have fun with them. That is. I'm gonna bomb you and attack you with uh, the speed. Speed is gonna do the damage here. Again, it has the mass of that freaking range. Five damage. Retaliation of nothing. Fudge off, bitch. Fudge off. Excellent stuff. Uh, the British bastards. Yeah, that we have the British paratroopers. We can go for a immediate starburst. No, we should not go for Starburst, we shall actually see what unit needs a replenishment, maybe. No, we will not. We'll immediately force our main guns of Navarone to attack a specific positions, break the siege of Tobruk, and move the fuck out of there. And do the right thing by me, and I shall do the right thing by me. It's amazing me. It's always me. Everything is me, 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 more me. Okay, moving on. Excellent. Well, let's get rid of the, the freaking artillery gun for now. Well, sorry, the AT gun, but it's the same shit. It's, it's the same principle as an artillery gun. Oh, come on, one, really? What the douchebagginess. But that's okay. The point is now we can actually sur surround the Wehrmacht infantry inside Fort Capuzzo. This guy is GT. Like, it wasn't point of getting experience, point of just get rid and get a little bit of prestige, if anything. And that's it. Uh, okay, that's it. I think that is mostly it. Our engineers. Let's see what shall we do with the engineers. Uh, we need to suppress them with every single soldier we have. That is the enemy. We're gonna move paratroopers here. We're gonna support whatever we can here. Attack you, oh my fucking god! That's an amazing goddamn gun! Jesus! 
17, 170 millimeter gun. Holy shit. 1411. Well, it shouldn't be a problem if we utilize uh, the these tactics or utilize our air power against that. It should not be a problem. Really, should not be a problem. First, concentrate destroying these guys, then move inside. You know, that's gonna be the problem, first and foremost. Suppress, destroy, move in. Suppress, destroy, move in. That's how we're gonna uh, roll with this specific tactic. Get the guys, you know, get them free out of there to Brook. Get these guys immediately to the point A. Capture all the positions that we really need. Again, I do not know if they, 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 this, that, they, that they're all golden rings, are the pos exact position that we need. Like, honestly, there are only three more positions that's the CDs. That's three, right? Amazing stuff. And you need four at least to hold to win in the trailer. Or capture all five objectives. Which means only three left objectives for us to really capture. And that's it. That's the main force here. It doesn't look problematic. We have a lot of turns, but it can go sour very fast. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to end here. No, I'm going to do one more turn and see how that's going to go and what we can actually really do in a long run. Okay, enemy doesn't do anything. I always like that when the enemy doesn't give two fucks about us. Let's get supply going. Whoa, what, what? Oh, you want to resupply? No, that's not how we work here. That's not how we work here. At all. Gonna suppress you, mother humpers. Wow, really? You missed? You actually missed. Is that that when that happens, that's a bad thing. That's a fucking bad thing. Matilda. Infantry. My heavy infantry, that is the Steel Legion, will be able to do something at least. We have to break out. Like these guys might prove problematic. Unless they move, don't move from that location, we can leave them where they are and just get these guys down this road and, you know, clear them. But, yeah. We shall see. We shall see. We shall see. Uh, okay, let me just check what I can move, what, what I cannot really fudge around with. And uh, specifically, I'm gonna get moving, attack you like a little bitch you are, thank you very much, you tried to attack, that's fine, run away like a little bitch you are, good stuff, good stuff indeed. Get you out of there, paratroopers over here, protect the flanks. The good stuff is happening guys, the good stuff is happening. What to do with our air specifically, 23, yeah, first. We need to resupply them with the everything that we have. Thank you very much. First resupplying, then move in. Resupply, move in. Doom and Quake, you bastards are evil, but you need to clear up a little bit. We definitely need to get, like, get rid of these bastards. Like, these guys need to leave. These guys need needs to leave, need to leave. Okay, see this? This is what I like to see. Five damage. Always a good thing. Now, these guys could do something. A complete annihilation. Thank you very much. Always a good thing. Matilda opening fire upon their inf infantry does massive fucking damage. And finish maybe off with the Lehman Rust. Lehman Rust doesn't do anything. Wow, that was kind of disappointing, Lehman Rust. That was kind of disappointing. But it's fine. You tried. You failed. He's gonna go, of course, here, but they're not gonna be able to entrench, so it's already a GG for them. It's already a GG for them. Fall back here, thank you very much. I think it's time to move in upon the enemy. With uh, what? We only have one infantry unit here and the goddamn 25 pounder. That's not good. That's not good, but we will have to do something with it. Uh, again, the range of this is two, right? So he will be able... No, he won't be able to retaliate upon us if we go here. Yeah. Open fire with 25 pounder. Nice. 
Uh, do you remember Bertha is here? She's able to, to give us support, maybe. No? 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 Yet? Yeah, no, no. She can't. She can't because she's not good enough. Oh, three. Nice damage. Nice damage indeed. I like that. I like that very much. Very much. These paratroopers can help out in controlling the right flank. They're auxiliary units anyway, so what's the point, right? Let's see. Quake, what shall I do with you? Move in close by here and do some evil thing or what? <laughs> it's the question, like, immediately move towards these locations now that we can clear... I mean, we can clear all this with what I have here. So I guess the smartest thing would be to do exactly this. You know, like, move specifically towards these cities now and try to encircle and destroy them slowly but surely. And that's it, you know, like, that's it. That's all we can really do. Or hope to do, at least. Okay. Uh, wow, like, these five or nine shoes. Uh, doesn't really matter, as long as we have the 25 pounder for that one attack and maybe possible suppression. No, of course not. Of course not. Nothing there, nothing gained, that's for sure. Gonna not gonna attack this. Not not worth it because we do need to get these Bersiglieris, Bersiglieris, and they are also very strong as is, as general of German infantry. I can't believe that he couldn't do the exact job I requested. So two turns we're gonna do anything. Good stuff, really good stuff there. Okay, well, uh, nonetheless, that's it guys. Uh, next time, more love.